Hi guys, it's Draws McHale here, welcoming you back to another episode of uh, the episode 7. How do you like the opening? I made it myself, you know, in good old Draws terrible animation standards, it's actually kind of okay because, I don't know, consistency. The Star Wars animations were okay, no they weren't, they were terrible, so. Other than that, I w I'm a terrible animator, so uh, I'm so glad I call myself that sometimes. I'm not, trust me, I'm a terrible drawer. I, the only thing I know kinda how to do is to make things move. So, and that's just a basic concept, it's not even super secret, so... God damn it, I just insulted all animators. Oh, I'm sorry guys. I'm not actually trying to insult everybody, I'm just, I, it just slips out. Ugh. This ep this level is just water and swimming in the game. Ray, everyone's favorite. The fuck. Oh, I just realized why I like Kirby so much. the The water levels are amazing because they they just fit. Okay, they just are good because swimming isn't annoying. You can always attack. It, yeah, it's just easy. So yeah, freedom at last. Kirby is our savior. I had no. <laughs> I was gonna go all freaking uh, in the now currently, and I didn't want to do that because I feel like I should be in, like I should be generally timeless. I should have gone in the first one here. I know. I'm a stupid. I am a stupid. So. Yeah, this this level is just pretty. It's just boring. What? Why? Why do I even have to explain anything? <sighs> bada bing, bada boom. What happened on the wall? So, had that. I've had that phrase stuck in my head for for literally years. Ever since I watched that video, I'm like, God damn it, bada bing, bada boom. What happened on the walls? Anyways, ah. Oh. I'm, I'm going to discuss a subject here that's been I, I've been doing the last few days. I love Legos because fucking who doesn't if they don't they're fucking they work at Mega Blocks and they're their competition so screw you Mega Blocks people. Uh, fucking Lego is the master race it's just like the PC master race but you know, it's actually good and fits together! God damn it, stays together. And, oh, jeez. I've just been building a ton of Legos by going to Brickset.com. Oh, by the way, big shout out to Brickset. Because they're fucking awesome. Basically, they give you instructions. And basically, everything about each set since a certain date. I don't know. So, they... The reason this brought this up, because I was thinking of, like, old shit, you know. Uh, I was thinking like, oh, remember when you were like four years old or 14, I don't know. And you got your f first Mac computer and you went to photo booth and you're like, oh, what are these effects? And then you're like, and then you just spent hours and it was super hilarious because you could bend your face. <sighs> that was funny to a fucking four year old, okay? I, I, was, I was doing that today because in my class... Basically, we just went over safety and it was like, oh, by the way, you have to learn how to use photo booth. And then we just did that for the, for the last half of the class. Uh, great class, by the way. Actually, I'm taking it twice. But it's a different class, so... Eh, not sure why I mentioned it. Anyways, the reason I brought up old shit is because... Fucking the other day on Brexit, I was like... Fuck it. Wait, what is that? Exo... Fucking Exoforce, man. That was sh that shit was awesome. Well, to me, it was like a Lego trying to be manga anime anime. <laughs> I know how to pronounce things. I swear. It's just in the moment. I'm just trying to talk as fast as I fucking can. So, ugh. Anyways, freaking Exoforce is awesome. It's just basically. The, hum the human race is getting invaded by robots, so they built their own robots to battle the enemy robots who built their own robots to become bigger robots? That makes sense? No? So, good, because you're like everyone else. Anyways, I remember because I had one of the original sets. I had like the, like, uh, the purple-haired guy, 
because there, there was like a few guys. There's uh, there's guy with black hair, the guy with, okay, the leader was the guy in blue, like I suppose the Raphael guy was the guy who had uh, green hair, and the uh, there was also the purple guy. I got the purple guy hair, whatever, and that was cool because I was five years old and like, oh cool mechs, and I still have pieces for it because y you still do, and. It was so cool because I just had so much fun because my brother got the uh, the matching robot version. They had just different colors. It was boring and sh as shit. The human robots were awesome because why the fuck am I talking about Exo Force? No one remembers it. I remember it because fuck. I had a ton of the sets. I had like maybe five, six. I have to give Pom for Yeah, five or six of them. And they were all awesome. Because you could move them around and it was robots and. Oh, you, the reason. Me and my brother had fucking Lego Wars. Uh, his. I had to custom build all my materials. Because I had no money. Because I still don't have any money. Whose fault is that? It's mine. But still. I didn't have any money. So I was just like, oh, I'm gonna build my own A-Wing. Because he had a V-Wing, that was his uh, main, like, ship. that shoot down all my ships because he's an unfair motherfucker. And, ugh. And that's it, pretty much, but... Uh. Anyways, the we just made uh, freaking Calamari out of that guy. But he wasn't a squid, and it wasn't, and it was cooked, so... I don't know why I said it. Anyways, back to my story, which I always seem to get in. And I was like, I need to tell more stories. Like, no, I need to tell less stories. Stop rambling, me. God damn it. I don't even talk about the game, because it's self-explanatory. It's a fucking platform. It's just water and platforms and abilities. Who cares? And, ugh. I had to fight that shit. Uh, let's see here. What... What did I think? Oh yeah, I built an A-Wing. It was like open cockpit. It was a piece of shit because I was four. My brother was eight. Four year difference between you and me, him and me. Uh, true fact. And, oh wow, I just realized I was... Every time I fought, concentrate on the game, I just, I just don't talk because I'm like, Oh, look at all the pretty colors and pictures. And yes, I do realize I am playing like a piece of shit, but that that's because I have I don't play this game very often. And what I do is Picard. That was a that was an unfunny joke. I apologize to you all. Have a have a nice day and just don't bother me. No bother me. I, I don't care. I, I just got my 40th subscriber, because my ultimate goal in life is to get 100 subscribers, and that shouldn't be- Oh, Spear! Spear's my favorite ability, my favorite my ability. Because of the range, Spears are my favorite weapon, and don't take that out of context, you motherfuckers. So, ugh. God damn it! I hate Spear Doomers, they're the most unoriginal, boring enemy in this game. I wish we could face Burdons, because at least then, we could get the wing ability! Oh well, rambling, adventure, excitement, none of this is on Draws Mikhail! Hooray! Except the rambling part, I'm sorry about that. I lied to you. <coughs> ah, ah, oh, sorry, I need to clear my throat. I was sick. Now, that's the reason I haven't made a video in so long. I was sick and my mic broke. All this is true, because if you noticed, I have a better mic. Either that or it's a quieter mic, because I got tired of fucking hearing shit in the feedback from my mic. So, yeah. Anyways, back to the war with my, me and my brother. Anyways, my mom put... Uh, what was that? She usually put all of my Legos in a Lego box, and the, my brother's like, Oh, it's in the Lego box. It's free domain. I'm like, no. It's not. You you shithead. What I, was, I didn't say shithead, because I was four years old. And anyways, this very long, boring level is over with me saying shithead. So I think this is the worst episode of Draws McHale so far. And that's saying a lot. No, it wasn't. Fucking one of the, uh, one of the Kirby's Epic Yarn was. 